First here at noon, the Tulsa Public Schools Board of Education votes to approve Dr. Ebony Johnson as the permanent superintendent for the district. Thanks for joining us. I'm Reagan Ledbetter. And I'm Autumn Bracey. News on 6's Michaela Glenn has the details on this vote and what's next for Dr. Johnson. Dr. Johnson tells us she plans to hit the ground running today as she begins her day as the new superintendent for Tulsa Public Schools. Dr. Johnson's new contract will now keep her as superintendent through June of 2026. Dr. Johnson says she's excited to take on this new role full time and begin hiring a number of open leadership positions. Dr. Johnson says she's looking forward to working on improving the district and plans to meet with students, teachers and the community. We spoke with her earlier on six in the morning. She tells us she looks forward to working with the State Board of Education. Education. I have every intentions of continuing to collaborate with our state. We need our State Department of Education. It's our State Department and Tulsa Public Schools working together and collaboratively that's going to get us to where we need to go. And the final vote was four in favor of Dr. Johnson, two against. School board member Dr. Jerry Griffin did not vote, so the board counted that as a third no vote. In Tulsa, Michaela Glenn, Oklahoma's own News on 6. In a statement this morning, Tulsa Mayor G.T. Bynum said in part, she has my full support as she moves forward in this new role. Tulsans have a long history of rallying around those with a great challenge before them. I'm hopeful that everyone who wants to see Tulsa Public Schools be better in the future will give her that same support.